Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Lisette Janae, Lisette with the S, not the Z. If you are new to my channel, I am a lifestyle content creator. I talk about things related to skin skincare, which I absolutely love. I talk about um, home decor, uh, fashion. I do vlogs with my friends, out with my family. Um, so if you, if any of those things interest you, and after watching this video, you enjoy it, please think about going ahead and subscribing to my channel, um, like and comment. So I want to share with you guys um, some luxury items as well as some um, pocketbooks as well as some loungewear. I just have a lot of things that I want to share with you guys. Now I have um, purchased these things kind of I would say throughout the course of the last two months so I just wanted to jump on and share them with you. Now I did just get a deep chemical peel so please excuse my appearance today as I am starting to peel. I also received a deep chemical peel on my hands. They are starting to peel as well as you guys can see here and it's starting to um, shed. This is right here. Um, this is the stage that I hate where it's just getting on everything. But um, apologies for the skin peeling. Um, I did try to just, you know, some of it was falling so I did try to get most of it off. Um, not to just totally gross you guys out. Um, so let's jump right into the video. So the first items I'm going to share with you guys are loungewear pieces. I picked up um, a few pieces from Skims. I picked up uh, a piece from Victoria's Secret and a piece from Target. Now guys, when I'm not out and about and running around and working, I love to just be home, relaxing and chilling out. I am a TV head. I love movies. I have all my, you know, special shows that I got that I like. Chicago PD, Chicago Fire, um, 911, Station 19, you name it. I'm here for it. I love all of it. So, uh, while I'm watching TV, I love to be, you know, just um, comfortable. I love to feel, you know, like just glamorous and sexy at the same time. So, anyway, without me rambling on, the first um, set that I picked up is from Victoria's Secret. So I picked this set up here. Um, they are lounge pants. Um, this is a drawstring. I love drawstring lounge pants, guys. And it does have two pockets here on the side. And they are extremely, extremely comfortable, guys. So love that. And it comes with the matching um, button-down shirt here. Love this. You have a pocket here on the left with the little Victoria's Secret uh, logo here at the corner. Love that. Here we go. So love, love, love that. And again, guys, it is extremely comfortable. So the second set I picked up from Target, it was in the clearance section. I believe they were like... Um, $20. So this one was originally $40 for the bottoms and I believe I um, picked up the bottoms for $20 if I'm not mistaken. This is in a size small. Um, this doesn't have a drawstring. It just has the little um, expandable waist here. I forget what you call this but uh, this style waist. It does have two pockets here. Nice and long, and I love these guys. They are so flowy, and I will be inserting clips of me just trying them on for you guys. So love the bottoms to this, and I absolutely love the color as well. And these are white flowers on white flowers, and it looks like maybe uh, tulips or something on it. But in any event, it's really, really comfortable as well. Here is the matching top. Love this. This has a, butt, a pocket um, on the side, on the left side as well. Love the sleeves on here, guys. It's a three, three button down sleeve. I absolutely love this. This actually, this lounge set actually can, um, I can get away with wearing it outside as well. So that's definitely a plus. So love that. And the top, guys, was originally $34.50. And it went down to $24.50. And it is by the brand um, La Ligne. I'm not sure how you pronounce it, but there I go trying to add a French spin on it. Ligne, right? 
<laughs> not sure guys but that's the brand the next two items guys i picked up are from skims now this first um lounge set i do have in black and i have in like a nudie color and it is the skims long maxi dress it's the um t-strap here t-strap dress so you have this love 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 how this fits as well guys it just clings to your body it just you know outlines your shape it just smooths over and is so comfortable oh my god guys this is absolutely amazing and i picked this up in a size medium and i absolutely love the color as well so i picked this up and then I picked it up in the same color, but a different cut. So I picked it up um, um, in this style. And again, same long maxi dress look here. And the both dresses are ribbed, guys. Both dresses are ribbed. So that's everything for loungewear, guys. So we're going to jump right into um, fashion pieces now. The next two items I picked up are from Zara. I picked up this scarf here. This bedazzle um, looks like, what is this? Let's see. So just this little stone um, scarf here in black. So I am excited to try to wear this, guys, for the holidays. And this was $29.90, and this is in a size medium. And it's made really, really well, guys, really well. Zara is doing a damn thing right now. I am scared to death because I am weak when it comes to them. And I was like, Lisette, you're supposed to be buying Christmas gifts now because Christmas will be here in a matter of probably, what, six weeks now, six, seven weeks. So, yeah, I am scared, so... Um, I picked that up. Then I picked up this beautiful skirt. The skirt is in a size medium. Now, I think I can do a large, guys, only because when I'm trying to put this on, it's tough to get on. But once it's on, it just smooths out um, and forms to my shape. So I love this. It's a sequence maxi skirt. So here we go. This is so beautiful, guys. It is so beautiful. And the price was excellent, too. $59.90. So this is really nice. So the next item that I picked up, guys, is this limited edition hoodie from The Gap. And it is by Basquiat. So we have it here. And I just got it in the white color. So we have it here. You have the uh, kangaroo pouch here in the front. And then you have... Um, the artwork in the back but you have this on the back of the sweatshirt and I thought this was super cool guys super dope and when I tell you comfortable oh my god this sweatshirt is extremely comfortable and I picked this up guys in a size medium um, I don't remember the price guys but as always anything that I mentioned to you guys here if I can find it I will link it in the description box below so the next items, um, guys, that I want to share with you are just some outerwear pieces that I picked up. This first item that I picked up is from um, Athleta. They were having a 30% sale, and it was the color that grabbed me. So this is in a gold color. So absolutely love this. You have Athleta here um, written on the side. Um, you have two pockets here, and then it just uh, zips up. So you have that and this guys i picked up in a size extra large because their things um are cut really small and i had on um i think i had on an all black sweatsuit when i tried this on and guys it looked absolutely amazing i was like i have got to get this um and running errands on the weekends you know if i have on a bulky sweatshirt um, or just a sweater sometimes just wearing coats and when I'm in and out of the car it's just too much and it's not too long where I'm not um, with you know it's um, restricting my legs and everything it's just it falls nice and right below my um, buttocks so I picked that up really really nice and guys this was originally how much was this 159 so when i saw the price i was like uh you guys have a sign on the window that says 30 percent off is this included because i was not going to spend 159 for this so i forgot that athleta athleta am i saying it right or athleta 
is a part of the whole chain gap and banana i totally forgot so because i do have a banana card and i had all these different rewards and points and you name it so yeah um i got this at a nice decent price so so next up guys is a jacket that um my girlfriend sold to me she actually ordered it for her but when she received it it was way too small way too small and this is the jacket that i also wore to the mary j blige concert so here it is so you have um the body of the jacket the base of the jacket is wool you have the gold buttons here and then the lapel here is uh faux leather so it's faux leather here on the front but when you turn it around it is wool on the back end then you have um, some nice shoulder pads here you have the baseball style um, stripes here as well as the faux leather white sleeve and then when you get down to the wristband it is the same um, white and black stripe here as well then on the collar you have um, it's like gold and white here and then just on when you flip it over it's just the base of the jacket which is black and I thought this was super dope and super cool and she was not excited that it did not fit her guys but um that's what having friends in different body sizes that's where we come in <laughs> so um i was able to fit the jacket and oh my god i love this i've even worn this jacket to work guys and everyone was like oh my god that jacket is so dope uh, my co-workers were giving me so many um compliments and of course i just dressed it i just had on some black slacks with it um and just a nice top and i wore this the next item up guys is this long cardigan that i picked up from urban outfitters i picked this up in a medium and it is is 45 percent acrylic 27 percent nylon 25 percent wool and three percent elastane and i picked this up again guys in a size medium and this was 149. i thought this sweater was absolutely amazing i love the colors in here um, I love the length of the sweater and again guys it has pockets on here that are absolutely amazing and again it's warm enough where if I'm running out running errands on the weekends going to my son's one of his um, many basketball games this comes in handy I can wear it with um, um, something like this or I can wear it with um, I could just wear it with anything honestly so absolutely love this and, it, and it's heavy but not too heavy where it's weighing you down it's heavy where it's going to keep you warm heavy if that makes sense so love. okay guys so the next two and last two outerwear items oh my god so the same young lady who um gave me the baseball jacket who's starting her own line she went to woodbury shopping asked me to go i was like nope because the last two times i went it wasn't even a hit or miss it was a total miss i said however if you see anything that's good or anything that you think i would like please let me know facetime me whatsapp me whatever so um i'm you know out doing my thing i don't hear from her so i reach out to her. i'm like girl anything good so she sends me a video and she's like l you know, I just found this piece. I'm going to just, you know, pick this up. I need something like it. Guys, I couldn't even finish the entire video she sent me. I called her ASAP and was like, listen, can you pick one up for me? What other colors do they have it? And she said, sure. Um, now, in the when she sent me the video, because I cut it off short and didn't even bother to watch the rest of the video, I didn't see the other colors. So um, she picked up the, the brown that I had originally asked for. And later when she came back, we were talking and I said, they didn't have silver fox. And she said, they did have silver fox. I said, I didn't see it. She's like, Elle, it's in the video that I sent you. Because I cut the video so short, I was like so thirsty, like I need that in my life. I didn't see the silver fox. Guys, I went online, they had the silver fox. I said, thank you, Lord. I said, let me just order it and see how it looks. I've had a silver fox full length coat for the life of me, guys. I don't even know where that coat is. And I bought this coat back in um, 
not the 90s, but the 2000s. I cannot remember where this coat is. I was wrecking my brain. In any event, guys, I'm rambling on. Don't know where the coat is, but I knew that Silver Fox always looked good against my complexion. So, the original wrap that she picked up for me is this beautiful brown color here. Do you guys see this? And this is by Bel Belfar. Let me just show you guys the name. So it's by Belfar. It is one size. It is just a wrap. And again, I'm going to insert footage of me just um, trying it on for you guys. Guys, this is absolutely beautiful. So the original price, which I should have mentioned in the first place, <laughs> was $1,400. It went down from $1,400 to $599. Um, and then she also mentioned if you spend over... I think it was $500, you get an extra $100 off of something. So I paid $465. So this wrap was $465, and it is in this beautiful brown color. Absolutely beautiful. I love this, and guys, it feels so good. It's so, so good. I can wear this out to brunch um, with my girlfriends. I can wear this out on a date night with um, my hubby. Um, I'll even wear this to, honestly, I'll even wear this to one of my son's games. Like, when he has, like, a big game, I'll wear this to one of his games. Absolutely, for sure. Absolutely love the brown, guys. But, again, I just had to order the silver fox just to see how it looks so guys here is the beautiful silver fox oh my goodness this silver fox guys is everything i mean the color the fur on it it is everything and then some absolutely beautiful and both of them guys are the same exact cut their capes the same exact style and i just love the back of it love 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 the back of it and again guys this was 465 as well so now my only dilemma is which one do i keep right so i'm like oh my god which one do i keep so i'm asking my girlfriend she was like keep the silver fox definitely the silver fox i was like okay it's a no-brainer i'm gonna keep it now the silver fox to me guys is really dressy right it gets a lot of attention so i'm like when i want to dress down without getting too much attention i mean they're both attention getters right but the silver fox definitely out there in your face more so then I asked my daughter, I'm like, babe, which one should I keep? She's like, ma, keep both. I'm like, I was headed to that direction, but I didn't want to. Ugh. I don't know, guys. I'm, I'm really kind of on a fence. And then I'm like, do I keep two of them the same style? Ugh. You know what, guys? Leave a comment for me down in the description box below and tell me what you guys think. I am actually leaning toward keeping them both, but I'm like, does keeping them both make sense? For my collection and what I have and what I know I have in my head and my wardrobe, um, yes. I don't know, guys. And then I have, um, if you guys watch my, my winter accessories, you guys know that I have a silver fox collar. And then I have the big um, trapper hat. So, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I'm still on a fence, but I know I don't have much time because I know my days are approaching where I need to make a decision fast before I'm shit out of luck on returning the brown. Um, I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, guys. So, yeah, just let me know what you think. Leave a comment for me. Um... Leave a comment for me below in the comment in the comment um, box. But guys, I absolutely love this. It is absolutely beautiful. And you know what's so funny, guys? Because with certain hairstyles, certain um, things look different. Like I tried this on when I had my super short pixie. Woof, mucho caliente, like fire. 
it, it, get, it doesn't do too well with my hair curly. I mean, it's still nice, but the, the short pixie, the red lip, the glasses, oh, it was just, it was just giving me life. It was doing everything it was supposed to do and then some. So let me know what you guys think. Definitely keeping the Silver Fox for sure. So I guess my question to you guys is do I keep the brown or do I just sell it, send it back? And I mean, the, the Silver Fox is dressy and it is what it is. I mean, listen, so it's dressy, go out, do what you do, and so what? So am I doing that? Or am I doing this like whenever, however? Or am I sending, or am I keeping a brown and kind of, you know, playing it down? You guys let me know. Help a sister out. <laughs> So the next two items, guys, that I want to share with you um, are two luxury pieces. So the first thing is um, I picked up this Dior set, and I ordered it strict, uh, straight from Dior. I haven't even opened this yet, guys. So Dior does uh, packaging beautifully. And I will say this is my first time ordering something straight from Dior. Um, this is absolutely beautiful, the packaging, that is. Okay guys, sorry about that. My light, um, my background light just died, but I'm going to just keep going guys. So I apologize for the lighting in the rest of this video. Um, so I picked up this three piece Dior lip set. So let me just unbox this with you guys. I mean, they have the packaging down to the T. Nicely packaged. So it's the Dior Attic Glow Set here. They even included some extra Dior ribbon, a nice little um, pouch here, a Dior pouch. Let's see what's in the pouch first. So we have a Christian Dior Oud, Oud Espagne. This is a fragrance, a sample. So we have this. I'm not even sure if I pronounced that last name correctly. And then we have a Bois, Bois de Argent. Focus camera. Okay, guys. Focus. Okay, so there we go. We have that. So these two samples were inside the Dior pouch, and these are um, 0.6 flow ounces. So that's cute. Love this little pouch here. Adorable. So then we have the Dior Attic Glow Set. So it comes with the lip, lip maximizer and the lip glow. And um one of my instagram followers posted this and i saw the pouch that she had and i said oh my god i need to order that just for the pouch like i am in love with the pouch and this is the pouch that i was talking about this pouch is so pretty guys it has the cd embossed in the velvet pouch here this blue is absolutely beautiful and then you have the gold uh, trimming here around the gold zipper rather sorry um, the zipper has Dior on it come on camera focus there we go it has Dior on it guys oh nice and smooth and then inside are the goodies well this is the goodie that I want so we have they made sure this was not going to get messed up so we have here we have the Dior Attic Lip Glow the packaging is really really nice guys I guess this is what happens when you become a big girl and you start ordering big girl stuff right so we have the Dior here really really nice love the top and again it has the Dior on it man this packaging is crazy then we have the lip maximizer hyaluronic lip plumper so we have this and again guys you have Dior um, etch, etched on the bottle 
this packaging is amazing amazing I can't wait to try this on guys this is so pretty if anything I am in love with the packaging like wow okay let's set you a big girl now you a big girl now okay big girl status but guys I am I am <laughs> I am so in love with this she had this on her Instagram and I believe she had um I believe she had the box listed as well but she put the pouch to it and I, I girl I said okay I need that set because I need that pouch it's just a pouch for me I just need that pouch and she was dying laughing so yeah I am excited about it so not only do I get this set but I also get the little um pouch as well so this is a really really great little um little set guys I might have to get this for my sister um, for Christmas because my sister, y'all, she's so bougie. That was always my inspiration, my, my big sis. She is so bougie. So she would love this. She would absolutely love this. So I am, so, oh my God, I love this little pouch, y'all. Why do I love the pouch more than and the stuff that was in it? Oh my God, I love, love this okay so enough of me ranting and raving about this um set so my next and last piece that i want to share with you guys okay so you guys knew about um the gucci bag the small crossbody that i picked up from woodbury um tried to get in love with it even removed the leather strap from it added a chain strap blah 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 only for my cousin to go out with me one night and like cuz oh i love that bag i said you love it would you like to buy it from me it's you know, I barely wore it, absolutely. So I sold the bag to her, gave her the leather strap, the chain, everything. I purchased, um, I replaced it with another Gucci bag that I tried to like, tried to love, but didn't even like it. So that wound up going back and that was a disaster at the Gucci store. Um, and then I found something that I'm going to stick with that I really, really like. It's a crossbody. It's classy. It's different. I don't have anything like it in my um, in my handbag collection. And it's from a brand that I've been eyeing for a very long time. And I went ahead and took the plunge and purchased it. And it is the... Well, first of all, let me tell you who it's from. So it's from St. Lawrence. And it is this beautiful patent leather St. Laurent YSL crossbody. Guys, <laughs> first of all, when I received the bag, right, I said, okay, did they try to play me? So it came <clears throat> wrapped like this. All of the hardware was covered. And then it had this tape around it <clears throat> and then I see this it's like a cheesecloth to me I call it a cheesecloth and it was around the strap to avoid the strap from hitting the bag again you have the tape here wrapped on the edges so I'm like no they didn't play me no they didn't send me a bag with cheesecloth on it with some tape wrapped around it like no 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 so I'm carrying on thinking that you know it was the okie doke and I'm like okay no this is going back so I marched my little self into Saks Fifth Avenue because I purchased it from Saks I marched my little self into Saks and at the time Saks was doing something where you spent I think like $700 and you got like a $200 gift card so I did get the $200 gift card so I'm thankful for that and I will be putting that to good use um, so I marched my little self into Saks and I'm ready to you know state my case and I show them so they're looking at me like, um, okay, and I'm like, is this, you know, the tape, the cloth? They said, oh, we, we, this is how we wrap bags. I'm like, oh, so this is normal? They go, yeah, they're like, um, so I'm thinking something's wrong with the bag. So they're looking at me like, um, no, nothing's wrong with the bag. So they're like, this is how we cover the chain so it won't scratch up the bag. I said, no, I know you have to um, cover the chain so it doesn't scratch up the bag, but I was concerned about the material that they used and the tape it looks like some regular tape that I have around the house you know using sometimes like masking tape so it looks like it's some masking tape and a cheesecloth around it 
so they assured me that there was nothing wrong with the bag this is normal procedure this is how they wrap um the chains so forth and so on now my girlfriend tink has one and i said hey how did your bag come wrapped so when i sent it to her she was like oh no but you know miss tinkerbell got uh purchased hers from i think she said barney's white glove service the packaging came different i said okay tink all right all right so i missed the barney's and all that other stuff <laughs> big girl <laughs> um that's big girl status um so in any event, guys, they assured me the bag was fine. They looked it over, um, and I'd rather them take the tape off and everything. So they removed the tape, looked at the hardware just to make sure that everything was fine. And again, I'd rather them do it and do it in person than me do it. And then it's like, um, if I needed to return it, then we have a problem. So they looked the bag over. The bag was um, perfect. Um... The sales rep put his white gloves on he was like i put my gloves on for you so he cleaned it up because it also came with a lot of fingerprints on it um so he wiped it down for me he cleaned it up and guess what guys i was happy i walked away with a smile um and i was just so happy and actually i got both of their cards they were amazing um sales reps so i did um take their business card and um i'm glad i kept the bag also because ysl just had another price increase and i don't know what's going on all these price increases i'm like oh my god um and while i was there i actually had on my uh louis vuitton pochette matisse so i removed some items from there and i put them in here and they fit perfectly they fit amazing uh the zipper is smooth everything is nice so here's the inside let me just move the stuffing so you have the inside here you have um three card pop three card slots right here on the inside and then it's just a big empty hole um no other compartment but it fits so much guys it fits all the things that i need you have a pocket here in the back as well and then i just love how classy and elegant um the black chain is um it falls on me the, the strap is not adjustable guys it falls nicely guys and i've tried it on um you know with my jackets and with my coats and it is it's really really nice so i am really happy about my bag I just love this i just think the black on black is just super dope is classy um and i don't own any patent leather guy bags guys so um this is this is everything guys i love the tassel here i love the black mat here um and it just has saint laurent paris here around the um around the zip and then the black leather tassel guys this bag guys oh my god it is so so nice how much is this it um so this was 12.50 12.50 and um then i got a 200 dollar gift card so yeah i cannot wait to start using that guys i'm excited so that's everything that I wanted to share with you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you've reached this far in the video, please think about subscribing. Um, comment in the bottom in the box below. Um, and yeah, so thank you guys for spending this time with me. I really appreciate it. And as always, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.